Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. In the following clip, I asked Muhammad Qasim an important question. Many people are making baseless statements and accusations that Muhammad Qasim says that he is the Mahdi. They have never seen him say this. If after watching this, you continue to make such statements, then you have slandered a man, made a false accusation with zero proof or evidence of such claims. Furthermore, you have made a clear lie. So may the curse of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be upon the liars. I hope that this clip clarifies to you all that he is not and has never claimed to anyone that he is the Mahdi. You have never claimed that you are the Mahdi. However, are you aware that there are people who claim that you are the Mahdi? What is your advice to those people who make this claim that you are the Mahdi? When you say you will never claim that you are the Mahdi, do you approve of their work or not? It's their own uh, thought and opinion. You don't need to say this. Just stay, uh, uh, share the dreams. Just share, share the dreams. dreams. But uh, some of them, they say uh, they have a dream about it. Okay. And um, some of them say uh, Allah put this in their heart directly. Hmm. So, so let me get this straight. So some people who help you, they say that they've had a dream and in the dream they've seen that you are this individual and that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has put it in their heart and they believe this with sincerity. Hmm. Yes? So they, yes. they go ahead with this because they believe and this. And I happened. told them, you have children, you have family and what if you uh, your claim did not come true mm. and I'm, and I am not that person mm. then what will happen mm. even your grandsons uh, will face these words oh your grandpapa uh, claimed this for the person and it did not come true mm. then what will you do think about it but uh, People will choose to do what they want to do. This is what people yeah. do, isn't it? People will do. Even what they I want. try my best to stop uh, Awas Nasir. Okay. And this is what happened. Uh, now it's like uh, one and a half year gone. I did not even speak to him on call or even on WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. No message exchange. So then I told to myself uh, it's their own opinion this way I will uh, it will happen with the others also uh, what is happened between me and Awes yeah so <clears throat> uh, let them uh, their opinion with them and I will keep saying I am not claiming uh, anything and you will see, I will not even claim me in the future, yes. ever. Even not you, you guys will not even hear from my mouth uh, big words. Mostly politicians say, when we will come in the power, we will do this, we will do that. But when they come on the power, nothing happens. Even uh, the situation become worse. Mm. So, uh, you, uh, inshallah, you will never see these type of big words from my mouth, uh, claim is uh, far away.